Okay, one of the next major uh, concepts in programming is to do conditions. Um, now a condition is basically this, if something, do something else. Um, now this is, uh, we're going to use this, we've got a little challenge here to make this stop when it gets to 10. So what we're going to do is we're going to um, drag in this straight after. Um, and what I'm going to do, because this makes sense rather than have to keep clicking this, I'm going to put it straight after the, um, the when the green is clicked. So when you do click the uh, green flag, you'll see that the store the score starts at zero. Now right now there's nothing inside the if something, so it doesn't know when to do this part of the code. So I'm going to stop for now. We're going to work on that. So um, the uh, operators are the place that you can do the comparisons, and you'll notice that these ones and these ones are the same shape as this, and um, this means that they all fit in here where required. So um, what we're going to do is, uh, if it gets greater than 10, we want it to stop. So um, we could use an equals, or we could use a less than, or we could use a greater than. So that's the greater than um, with the, the big side on the left. That's the less than with the small side on the left, and that's the equals. Um, and we can add values into here. So what we're going to do is we're going to say if drag that in. I'm going to say if the uh, variable score, and we just drag it in, is greater than 9. So the value 10 would be greater than 9. And I'm just going to go over to the control section and say stop all. So this should be a nice simple way to adapt the code that we have. When we click on the green arrow, we start at 0. It will now inside this forever loop, it will loop round um, changing the score by one, wait in a second, and if the score is greater than nine, like it is right now, it does stop all, and you see the value stops on the top left hand side. So the conditions are really important in, in programming if you want something to happen based on one of the variables or some kind of condition, like if the player presses a key, or if the score gets to, to 100, or if the health equals zero, then you're gonna have to have conditions. And that's the whole of challenge number two. Three, sorry.